Hey everybody, this is Stephanie. I'm doing the Project Life process. And then we're getting into March, and I'm a little behind already. February was a busy month for me, and all in that, I was also in a funk. So this is me catching up on Project Life. Here we are, this is week six, and I grabbed out a Studio Calico collection. I believe this is the Fresh Start. I got the printable version, so I already had these printed out. And I am just kind of picking out the colors for this uh, spread. I really love that heart paper there to be my title card. But um, as you can see, all of my photos kind of had that darker blue and the greens and just not Valentine's Day. But I really struggled because it was, you know, the start of um, February and I really wanted that heart. But I go with my gut and... Or I guess I actually don't go with my gut. <laughs> I go with the color choices that I have in my pictures. So sorry, it's off camera. I got a new mat, as you can see. And um, I didn't really uh, readjust. But uh, for future videos, it'll be better. So, uh, yeah, I live in Texas. So as you know, in February, we had a snowstorm that week. We did have issues with our power and our water. However, it was not nearly as bad as other people had got, so I'm super thankful. And we did enjoy the snow while I was there before everything else kind of, you know, hit and uh, scare <laughs> us. But um, and then I was just in a, in a bit of a funk before that. But um, so um, grabbing out this collection, I noticed how the colors kind of really um, took off with these speech bubbles that are from, what are they from? I'm trying to recall pink fresh studio super cool uh collection and i noticed that since when you're doing the printable version of anything some of them do may not come with embellishments or stickers and that's how it works for the studio calico so i had to go within my stash and use what i have and i'm really happy that i did since i've had this collection the remains of the speech bubbles and some stickers here and i'm really glad i used some of my stash here so I'm trying to see, and as you can see, um, I'm trying to finish off this sticker, these puffy stickers, and I think I only pull off like maybe one or two, but little progress is still progress, right? <laughs> I have my morning coffee here, so if you hear me gulping, that's all I'm, I'm just enjoying some coffee, guys. I am checking to see which sticker is gonna go good with these pictures oh so let me talk about the pictures i'm rusty can you tell <laughs> so the first photo there on the uh left side next to the title card it is a collage of three different photos of an event that we went to it was not an event event it was just a outing for some ice cream we went to Dairy Queen, and as you know that alone in itself is an adventure since we do not get out much due to life right now with COVID and everything else. Um, so it really was a nice treat to just get out of the house and do something these days. And I just took some photos of, of us and my middle child and my hot fudge sundae since it was so yummy. <laughs> and moving on to the next row on that left side still, um, it is a photo of my middle child again. We were playing what is it called? Monopoly, like on the go. It's like a card version and it's very different, but I really uh, enjoyed it. And I think I won. I had won that day. So of course I was killing it. And um, I just love that he likes to play these little games um, after school. This is the time that we and him, we get to connect and, you know, just do something since, you know, his days go by pretty fast. Oh, and especially now that, uh, he is jumping into baseball, so coming up in the next few weeks for Project Life, you'll be seeing a lot of pictures from him and his um, practicing on those days. So I have things to do now, and I just find it so, so crazy to be a baseball mom, and I'm really excited for him. <laughs> All right, moving on to the next photo. It is dinner. Um, my husband, before he left to work, he wanted pot rose, and he decided to start it in the morning. So he, we had that slow cooking all day. What a torture it was. The aroma of the meal was just intoxicating the entire house. And I didn't think there was going to be any left by the time everybody made it home. But it was, it, 
I did sound for a piece, I'm not going to lie. That's why I took that picture to show my husband. I don't know what happened to it. <laughs> Here I am trying to decide which one I, which uh, title card I'm still on the fence. Normally I get that done. And out of the way, that's probably well, since um, I'm struggling, I normally get that done first. Especially if I don't know where I'm, I'm aiming, it kind of leaves everything else kind of like, uh. So this is just me checking things out. There on the lower left portion of the left side, that photo, it is my husband and then Mason, my middle child, practicing in the yard. The baseball, since we were going to be doing tryout that week, and they basically told us that everybody makes it in, but it's still a protocol, you know, and to see where they're at and where to place in them into teams since there was a big gathering and then they break them down. It's such a big thing in this town that we now live in, and I'm just, I'm excited. I'm over the moon. Um, now moving on to the right side of my project life, the first photo that says have fun. It is my husband and my toddler. They are sitting on the trampoline. This is before the boys made it home. And, um, we let our toddler just run around on there before the bigger ones got home. And <laughs> basically he would not be on, be able to be on there. He had so much fun, just so much fun. And then they're on the right side next to that one where it says everything today totally rocked my, I remember my little child coming home and he's like, today was a good day. And we did this, we did this. And I'm like, oh, well, I'm so sorry to be a damper to you, but y'all left something out in the backyard. Y'all should go check that out. And then, and it was just to surprise him with the trampoline. And he didn't realize what it was. He's like, what do we leave? What do we do? And he's looking around, he's looking around. And then he finally was like, oh. <gasps> <laughs> and it was just so cute oh man i was rambling a little too much there pass me up so here is with all the journaling and how i adhered all those speech bubbles with a tiny attacher i hope you enjoyed the process and how simple it came out and until next time don't forget to uh, subscribe to watch uh, future videos that will be posted on fridays for my project life thanks for watching until next time bye